Just days before the Grammy Awards, which air Sunday night on CBS, the suspended president and CEO of the Grammys is hitting the Recording Academy with a discrimination complaint. Jamie Yukis reports tonight on the new allegations. Hi, everyone. I'm Deborah Dugan. Deborah Dugan was the Grammy's first female chief executive when she was ousted last week, just 10 days before the award show. Today, her attorneys filed a federal discrimination claim on her behalf, charging the Recording Academy with sexual harassment and retaliation, reminiscent of those deployed by individuals defending Harvey Weinstein. One of her attorneys represents a Jane Doe who's scheduled to testify in the Weinstein trial. Today's charge says that the Academy sought to destroy Dugan's reputation by leaking false information to the press. As recently as last month, Dugan gave interviews promising a major restructuring of the award show. In the charge, she claims there are voting irregularities when it comes to the nominating process, favoring artists with Academy connections over big names like Ed Sheeran and Ariana Grande. In a new statement to CBS News, the Academy says Dugan never raised these grave allegations until after claims she had created a toxic and abusive work environment, which Dugan denies. The Academy says it has opened independent investigations to review both Ms. Dugan's potential misconduct and her subsequent allegations. Nora? Jamie, thank you.